player, and he's already showed how good of a guy he is. Third and 25 in the end zone. Edwards gets rid of it. That may be a safe. We knew that this pit, pit defensive line was going to be a challenge for, for this New Hampshire team, and yeah, he, he couldn't do that. that. That was a tough play right there. Pitt with eight in the box. Here they come again. That's going to be picked off by Mathis. Down the sideline. Touchdown, Pittsburgh. They're getting pressure after the quarterback. And then they're making, making him make mistakes. There was a miscue between a quarterback and a receiver. And we'll see. He may have stepped out of bounds. We'll take a look at this one. It was left foot, Eddie. What do you think? Yeah. What about the seven-yard line? I was wrong the first time. In the red zone, pick it to the air. He lets it go. Touchdown. Shot Louie in the back of the end zone. To the air again for Pickett this time. He throws it to Addison. Nice move, and he stays on his feet. Jordan Addison breaking free, and he will score. Getting effort by Jordan Addison. You just get it to him in space. He's able to cut back. You're not supposed to be able to do this in college football. This is Reggie Bush-like. And he uses the speed to get to the end zone. He's even jogging halfway there. That's how good this kid is. He's going to able to come out and make plays. Why not? Why not get him this experience in a game like this? And we see Pickett still going deep. Deep one. Addison's got it. Perfect touch. Got the look that he was looking for. His number one receiver and man-to-man -man coverage. And not too many people's running with that guy. Hammond stretches across, plows with those legs, and scores. His third touchdown of the game. A homecoming victory for the Pitt Panthers. They improved the three and one.